my YouTube channel. Okay, you guys, so for this week's video, I will be doing the A Boy Broke My Heart prank. I'm gonna be doing this prank on all of my brothers as well as my mom. So if you guys are excited, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up right now, and let's get this video started. Woo! Okay, it is now time to prank my brother Bryce. So for this one, I'm going to get a phone call from a boy that I'm supposedly talking to, and I'm gonna be really upset on the phone because, you know, this guy's breaking my heart, and we're gonna get Bryce's reaction to that. Hey. I'm here. So I had a few ideas for next week. So for last week, the last to leave the bed, I feel like that one was like, good. so maybe something like kind of similar. Hello? What? Hold on, why are you yelling at me? How could you do that to me? Who is that? So now you're calling me names. Who is that? Are you kidding me? Lexi? I can't believe that you would do something like that. I really can't decide to call me names. Lexi. Go away, Bryce. I really didn't think that you were like that type of guy. Like I thought you were a nice guy. Like why are you calling me names when you're the one in the wrong? Okay, I don't care. I honestly don't care. You can do what you want. Like if you want to leave me for her, then go ahead and do it. <laughs> he just hung up on me. Lexi? Go away! You can't be in there all day. Come on, get out. Come on. No. What's wrong? Are you gonna tell me or no? This guy I was talking to just like who? left me for another you, girl. You never said who. I don't even know who this is. You don't who know. Go about? away. <laughs> all right. Well, I'm gonna give you some time, but no more than 10 minutes. I feel bad. You, you can definitely tell that he like was sad and doesn't really know what to do. So it sounded like Bryce just went downstairs. So in the meantime, I typed out a little paragraph looks like something that I would send to the boy that broke my heart, but I'm going to send it to Bryce and then text Bryce and be like, oops, I didn't mean to send that to you. But this is what the paragraph says. I can't believe you do something like that to me. I trusted you and you let me down. Have fun with your other girl. I'll be awaiting an apology for how you treated me and how you broke my heart. Shame on you, Justin. <laughs> so you guys, I literally don't know a Justin, but I just thought that I needed to make up a random name just to write a little bit better of a storyline. So let's copy this and send it to Bryce. And so I just sent the paragraph to him and now I'm gonna say, I didn't mean to send that to you. <sighs> okay, now we wait. Lexi. What? Is this what you meant to send Justin? Who's Justin? None of your business. Do I know him? No. Does Brett know him? Nobody knows him. All just... right, well, I'm gonna go make sure then. I'm gonna, I guess we'll figure this out. Figure what out? We're gonna, I'll, 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 see, I'll see what's up. I'm gonna find him. Huh? Bryce, where are you going? Oh, hold on. What? Don't go yet. Wait, Bryce! <laughs> are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? This is a prank. Are you kidding me? You can't go looking for a Justin because there is no Justin. And there's no boy that broke my heart. Oh my god, you deserve to have your heart broken now. Oh my god! That's it. What? Alright, it's time to prank Brent. So basically, I'm going to pretend like I'm getting ready for a date. And we're gonna get Brent's reaction to that because Brent hates when I go on dates, as I'm sure you guys can probably assume. But it will not stop there because I'm going to act like the guy that I was supposed to go out with stood me up and that I'm super heartbroken by that. So with that being said, let's start this prank. Brent! Can you come here? Um, can I borrow some toothpaste I ran out? Um, yeah. I'm not wondering why I'm so dressed up right now. Like, what? Thank you. You're welcome. Where are you going? On a date. On a date? Yeah. With who? I don't think you know him, but like, I really like him. I'm really excited to go out. I don't know him. No. What's his name? Um, Ben. But not the Ben that you're thinking. It's a different Ben, which is kind of ironic. So no one knows this guy? No, but like, I know him and I trust him and I'm uh, I don't know about that. Okay. When are you supposed to be here? Uh, like 20 minutes. Okay, well, I'll meet him then. You want to meet him? Yeah, because he might be weird. Okay, you can meet him. I'll tell you when he's here. Alright. Okay, this cannot have gone any better because now Brent wants to meet the guy that's supposed to pick me up to go on a date tonight and the uh, guy's not gonna show up. Okay, so it's already been like 40 minutes past the time that the guy was supposed to come pick me up. So now I'm gonna pretend to call the guy and act like it's going straight to voicemail like this guy's just ignoring me. And we're gonna get Brent's reaction. God, straight to voicemail again. Like, what the heck? Like, I What? How long has it been? What time is it? Yeah, it's already 40 minutes. He's supposed to pick me up 40 minutes ago. 
Oh, well. Um, yeah. I mean. Oh my gosh. What? He posted on his Snapchat story. Oh. And he's with another girl. Oh my gosh. Hey, at least. Uh, oh my gosh. You know that he's not the right one now. We're probably not a good guy then. Don't worry about it. Just... I was so excited to go out with him. Uh, there'll be other people. Uh, if you want to get food, I'm trying to get food like Cynthia. Yeah, maybe, because I'm supposed to get dinner with Dad. Alright, so what, what do you want? I don't know. What is that? Uh, we can get sushi. You know, good thing you're taking me out to dinner because no one else was going to. Huh? This was a prank. <laughs> there was no date tonight. Are you kidding me? <laughs> no one stood me up. What is wrong with you? Why no, no one broke my heart tonight, Brent. Good, but that's ridiculous. Why are you making up fake boyfriends? Boyfriend. Stupid. I don't want to get food with you anymore. No, you were such a good brother. Bye. Oh, All right, so I cut my hair. Okay. I'm just kidding, but that is going to be the next prank on my mom. So some of you guys might know this, but when girls get their heart broken, they tend to want to like switch things up a little bit. So whether that be dyeing their hair or cutting it. So basically, I'm going to be texting my mom, telling her that I got my heart broken by a boy, and then I'm going to FaceTime her and show her my my new look. All right, so I'm going to start by texting my mom. I hate boys. And no, we're just gonna see what she says to this. She goes, what? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Okay, so I'm gonna say, they just suck. Exclamation mark. Okay, you guys. So after I said, they just suck, my mom is FaceTiming me now. Lexi. What? Lexi. What? Did you cut your hair? Yeah. Oh my God, seriously, why? Because this boy that I like, said that he liked girls with short hair, so I just thought I would do it. Who but is the boy that you like? It doesn't matter, because he broke my heart, so. Okay, so you're telling me there's a boy that broke your heart, so you your hair. Yeah. Does that sound like a reasonable thing to do? First of all, yeah. Oh, who's the boy? You don't know him. I know everybody that you hang out with. I better know him. I'm freaking out. Why are you freaking out? It's just a prank. <laughs> I didn't cut my hair. Huh? Oh my gosh, she just hung up on me. Oh my gosh. She broke my heart. It's not a boy, it's my mom. All right, you guys, so my mom is going to help me out with this next prank on my brother, Blake. So basically, I'm going to be sitting on the couch, crying, eating ice cream, doing all the typical things that would happen after someone gets their heart broken. And my mom is going to text Blake and be like, hey, can you check on Lexi? A boy just broke her heart, and uh, we're gonna get his reaction. No, he's not gonna be happy with the boy that broke your heart. I don't think so either. All right, so I have this huge tub of ice cream, and now it is time to make it look like mascara has been running down my face from crying all day. Let's you are so mean, your poor brother. That's what little sisters are for. All right, so far so good. All right, so does it look like I've been crying all day? Oh, honey, it does. <laughs> sitting here crying, eating a tub of ice cream. I think you don't do this. Yeah, I'm pretty upset. Why? Because this boy, like. Who? You don't know him. I like to get to know him. What's his name? No, you don't want to know him. Like, he called me what? names and hooked me up and he sends me pictures of him with another girl. Like, the Give me his name and his phone number and let me talk to him real quick. I want to meet him. I don't think he wants to talk to you. I don't care, Alexi. Don't worry about it. Just give me your phone. He's not going to want to talk What's his name? Luke. Luke what? Alexa. Luke Skywalker. <laughs> No, he has a lightsaber. <laughs> this was all a prank. A boy didn't break my heart. But um, any boy, if you're watching this, now you know not to break my heart because he might come after you. Not anymore. <laughs> what? All right, you guys, that is going to be it for this week's video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. All of my family's reactions were very sweet, so I know that if a boy were to ever break my heart, that they would be there for me. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you guys next week. Bye.